Alright, welcome back to this playthrough for Wing Commander 4. And now we're going into the last mission, not only in the tier system, but in the um, the B branch of missions, at least according to my, my guide that I'm following. Anyway, let's get into this. And I'm going to go ahead and drop it down to veteran difficulty off the beginning because I'm tired of ace difficulty. Anyway, let's see what Eisen has to say. Ah, Colonel. Confed has deemed this an especially critical mission. Any particular reason? Let's get down to business, shall we, Colonel? Yes, sir. Enemy reinforcements are headed this way, so we have to move fast. A trooper transport has just joined up with us. They'll be moving in right behind you, carrying the ground personnel who will nab the hostage. Thanks to your recon, we know just where we're going and what we're up against. The hostage is located in this structure. Now, you'll need to cover the trooper transport's descent to that location. Then make sure it gets back here in one piece. Is that clear, Colonel? Consider it done. Well, I don't think I'm going to have much of a configuration here. Yeah. No ship change. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna keep that. Alright, here we go. Alright, here we go. Break formation and open fire. We're gonna give them some maniac magic. Break formation and open fire. We're gonna give them some maniac magic. This is Troop Trans 535. We have collected the package. Get us out of here, Colonel. Mission complete. Liar.
I've actually done a lot better that part before. That's not the problem. The problem is what's about to come up, and I am not going to deal with it anymore. Because I am sick and tired of it. That's right. I am turning him over for one. Break formation and open fire. Gonna give him some maniac magic. Of course, I have a busted windshield. It's gonna make me seem like do that really hard. <laughs> Need clearance. Extraction successful, Colonel. We're on our way out of the system. You have clearance. Companies come in. Captain Hugh Paulson attached to the Third Fleet with orders from Regional Command. Welcome aboard, Captain. They must be important orders indeed for you to personally carry them so far. All Confederation orders are important, Captain. The Lexington is to head immediately to the Massa system where we will rendezvous with the Third Fleet. I'll inform my helm. You will be filling me in on Confed's orders. Oh, we have much to discuss. In private, Captain? Uh, perhaps we'd better adjourn to my cabin. That's all about. Colonel Blair, report to the briefing room. Message from Confed HQ. Let me save the game just in case. That bioconvergence chemist we sprung from tier seven. Oh, I, oh, what? Bioconvergence. 
Try downloading a science update once in a while. Well, since when are you, Mr. Wizard? Hey, I don't just rest on my laurels like some people I know. Anyway, now I know why they were turning the border worlds upside down looking for this egghead. We are talking. Fine. Thought you weren't interested in any woman with an IQ higher than a wingnut. Oh, au contraire, mon frère. Eh? Didn't think I knew that stuff, right? Hey, Maniac does what he has to do. Okay, tonight, I'm boning up on my periodic table of elements. <laughs> if you know what I mean. So what, you figure her recent trauma makes her that desperate, huh? It's not unheard of to show a little appreciation to your liberator. <laughs> this guy's good, Colonel. The best. You never show any mercy, do you? You know, I seek only to instruct. The youth seeks wisdom and experience. <laughs> so what do you think about the new brass that just came aboard? Oh, uh, Paulson? Too many cooks in the kitchen. Always trouble. Kid asked too many questions. New brass. <laughs> Pain in the ass. Yeah. Things get a little top-heavy when there's too many higher-ups around. He's got a point, you know. Uh, maniac. All right, well, I don't feel like doing a mission briefing right now, especially since I think it's going to lead me right into another mission. So anyway, um, I did do a little bit of research last night on this game, and apparently I'm not the only one who's having, or who's had, a hard time playing this game. The, uh, the fact that you get hit with one missile and you're instantly dead is pretty, well, it's pretty asinine, to, to say the least. So, the difficulty of this game is not something I'm a big fan of right now. But, I've decided at this point, to heck with it all. Um, if I play through a mission and it takes me too many times to try and get through that mission, I'm not going to sit here and bang my head against the wall anymore trying to just deal with the difficulty because I want to play the game I want to have fun and if they're just gonna it's not even a challenge you know to, to get hit once and die that's not a challenge that's just not fun especially when, when you hit them and they don't die kind of thing so anyway I want to try to limit my use of invulnerability but at the same time if I have to use it, I have to use it. Anyway, that'll do it for this video. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.